Hello there, I am Giant Gold from my Pokemon Ruby Redo. In the last part, we took on the Mount Chimney um, against Team Magma. We fought um, Team Magma Grunt, Team Magma Admin T Tabitha, and then Team Magma Leader Maxi. And they didn't give us too much trouble, which was good. We got the meteorite back, um, and Team Magma left. Archie said, good job, Steven, and he left too. With t the other Team Magma, Team Aqua Grunts and Team Magma Grunts all kind of just left. And then we went through the Dragon Pass, we got Spoink right here, nicknamed it Twinch, Twitch, and uh, we taught Shockwave. And uh, yeah, um, I think that's what all we did. And we shut off at Summary, I think we, yeah, we only taught Shockwave by TM Cool. We teach him TM34, I think, Shockwave, or no, it was 34. It was, um, I think it was TM34, I don't know, I could be wrong. I'll put a text over here on what TM it was, TM number, I should say. So yeah, let's, uh, we have still Twitch up front, we battle also one of the trainers up on Mount Chimney as we left, and we bought two lava cookies. So that's basically what we did, and we got Pokemon Egg 2, by the way, that I told evolved, uh, hatches into, uh, Why Not, which is the pre evolution of Wobbuffet, so that's pretty cool. So yeah, I finally made it to Mount Chimney, I want to make my Pokemon battle. To make my Pokemon battle, okay, that makes sense, yeah. Cool. Here's another beauty, I guess, spirit type trainer, Sheila, I guess, yeah, Shumesh, nice. Let's go for the Psybeam, I guess. Too bad Shumus isn't half poison type, because that'd be super effective, but Shumus is pure, pure grass type. Headbutt, ouch, okay. okay. I think we're fast on that, so we may be able to defeat this thing. Mega Drain, okay, that's not gonna help us. It's gonna gain some HP back too, jeez. Yeah. Gotta hurry up and knock this thing out before it knocks Twitch out, you know? Sunspore, okay, it missed, good. Yeah, side beam hit. Awesome, this should do it. So we're able to take on the streamish, awesome. Defeat a beauty suit, okay, cool. The way you battle, it's like Mount Chimney, it's like a Mount Chimney erup eruption. Nice, thanks for the compliment. And also thanks for the 1,760 pocket dollars. I appreciate it, beauty Sheila. So there's also one more trainer, I think, right here. This is a old elder, yeah. I've been to the hot springs and I refreshed my tired bones. Right now I'm feeling strong. That's good to know. That's always good. So this is a expert Shelby. So she's a mad tight, okay. So Cybeam will be super neutral effective because, you know, uh, mad tight's a psychic and fighting type, you know. Not very effective, haha. -ha. But my side beam is gonna be neutral effective on this meditate, or switch side beam is gonna be neutral effective. We're confused, awesome. There's a little chance of confusion there too. Nice, hit yourself in confusion. Yeah, it's awesome. Side beam hits again, awesome. I'm gonna finish off with a shockwave actually. Snapped out confusion, oh no. This gives mind reader, so it takes aim, but that's okay. This meditate should still go down after the shockwave. There we go, awesome. There goes the Twitch. Twitch grid level 19, awesome. Just try to sight up. Um, I won't let it win sight up actually, I don't really need it. They let me sight up, okay, cool. Because is about to snap Makita, awesome. Makita is weak against psychic type moves, it's gonna be super effective if you use one on him. On him, yeah, it's a female, it's a male Makita level 22. Cool, it's gonna fake out, jeez. Okay, fine, whatever. Let's go for another side beam. Let's go for try another side beam, I should say. There we go, and it does a little bit of half. I should I I'm really worried I should have healed here, because if the Makita doesn't hit itself in confusion, it might it'll attack obviously. And oh my gosh, another vital throw, shoot. Oh he'll uh, it, it survived by one HP, awesome. So then the side beam hits, awesome. That way switch still gets experience. Nice. We'd be the expert Shelby. Oh my goodness, now I'll do something. Thanks for 800 day pocket eyes. We appreciate it. There's another trainer right here. Let's use a super potion on uh, Twitch though. I think it'd be the best thing to do, really. Or one of the best things to do. Nice, okay. Yeah, let's take on this trainer who's just running in place, it looks like. I've got. The fire in my baby. I can't stand it. I have to battle. Okay, we'll have a battle then. We'll have a battle. Okay, Beauty Melissa. Cool. Sent out Meryl. Okay, good thing Spoink has, or Twitch has Shockwave because it's going to be super effective now. Awesome. 
Nice, okay. Did about one third, that's nice. Let's use, let's use Bumblebeam on Twitch, that's fine. Doesn't do too much, that's good. Okay, one more side beam, uh, not, one more shockwave should defeat this uh, Meryl. And I guess the side beam could also faint it, but I'm just got all shockwave, I guess. So this Meryl's level 22 and it's female, but it's gonna have to go down. Yeah, there we go, nice. So 273 experience, awesome. Twitch in level 20, awesome. Defeated Beauty Melissa. Oh, that was a Scorching Hot match. Thanks. It's 1,762 pocket dollars too. Okay, I think we're done on Mount Chimney because all these trainers, I think we have faced all the trainers now. I like the music for Mount Chimney, by the way. I forgot to mention that in the last part. It's kind of catchy. I like the beat and stuff. Okay, so I have to go the right way here for it to work. Okay, yeah, let's go this way. Oh, I have to go down. I have to go through here and again to get the item, though. Oh, wait, no, I don't actually. I can go down in the right. That's awesome. Jagged Pass is hard to work to walk on. It's a good place for training. That's true. This is a kind of good place to train, but it's probably not the best place to train in all phone. But it's a good place to train, I guess. Can't be within like the battle case. Sent out six to go. Nice, cool. Let's go for the side beam on this thing. Okay, yeah. Oh, it confused. Awesome. So it's looks like it's gonna get hit itself in confusion, I hope so. Nice, awesome. Let's go for the side wave. We haven't used that move yet. Side wave barely oh man, that's, that's poor accuracy though. Shoot. Whatever. Hit itself in confusion, okay. That's okay, the six is gonna knock itself out really. Okay, whatever. Taylor, okay. We'll actually stay in because Switch has shockwave, which is super effective. So let's go for the shockwave. Just yeah, I guess quick attack, of course you are. There we go, okay. Nice. Taylor goes down, awesome. Wait, I'm gonna look up real quick on my other computer right now. I'm looking up to see if uh if uh Splink or Grumpig can win the Thunderbolt by TM, because that's actually slightly better than that's like a lot better than Shockwave, honestly. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep Shockwave just for temporary purposes. Oh, I can not learn, you know, Thunderbolt. So it doesn't look like it can learn uh, Thunderbolt as a Spunk, but what about as a Grump Pig? I'm looking that up and it's the computer now, so that's why I might like a pause state right here. So, uh, yeah, enjoy the victory music for a little bit. <laughs> My commentary of me doing this Shockwave. Let's see, TM24 I think is Thunderbolt. It's between Iron Tail and... Okay, TM, you can win Iron Tail, but not Shockwave, because the next TM number after that is um, 27, so it goes from 23 to 27. It doesn't look like it can win Shock, uh, uh, Thunderbolt, which kind of stinks, that'd be better much type move, honestly. Maybe when I'm a big being off a Sapphire, it can, but I don't know about regular Ruby Sapphire and Emerald, because it doesn't look like it. Of nature. So let me look one more time. It doesn't look like it, so we're gonna have to stick with chocolate. That's okay, I was just making sure. Let's go back to the Splunk's page. Because Splunk, it, I, have, I have its page open to remind me that to, to keep it to what level about level 35 or level. You have to level 35 when it wins. Uh, um, uh, Psychic as a spoink um, at level 20, at level 34. So there we go. Keep your, sorry to wait. It's hard to keep your waiting camp for Ethan. Uh, it, it was all over while we were still trying to fight find a good footing. Sorry, man. Thanks for 336 poker dollars though. So if we go down and to the right, we can actually get this item, which is a burn heal. Very worth picking up, I guess, if your Pokemon gets burned. Yeah, this is awesome. And I think that's really about it. So he covered everything in Jacket Pass, I'm pretty sure. I'm like 90% sure. If I have missed anything, something, I missed something, I guess. So I want to take on the gym next. Should have time for it, actually, so that's good. Um, I'm going to heal up at the Pokemon Center. So I'll be right back. Okay, so let's take on the uh, Laveringe City Pokemon Gym. Laveringe Town, or Laveringe Town, okay. Pokemon Gym Leader Flannery. Uh, one of the fiery... One with a fiery passion that burns. That's awesome. Let's go inside the gym, though. 
So I don't remember the gym puzzle exactly for this gym, so that kind of stinks. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to kind of go off memory and try on her basically. Hey, how's it going, Champion Balance Steven? Leverage gym leader for anyways. They use, a, use fire type Pokemon. Her passion for Pokemon burns stronger and hotter than a volcano. Nice, nice. Um, I think that's a nice simile actually. If you just like her as, <laughs> don't get too close to her, you'll burn. Hose her down with water and then go for it. Okay, cool. So uh, one of these is a trainer. I think the right one's the right circle is a trainer actually. Leverage Tom Pokemon Gym. Yeah. yeah. Here we go. First trainer. Oh, oh, oh yikes! It's hot. So, well, don't lay down there. You know, getting your body temperature all high and stuff. Jeez. <laughs> Slugma, cool. It's level 22. Let's go for the side beam on this thing. Let's see how much it does. Does ha over half. Awesome. Let's, okay, Ember is gonna hurt. Okay, didn't, I did a significantly less than I thought it would actually, so it's good for us. Nice. Okay, so Twitch is almost level 21. Awesome. Slugma, cool. Stay in. Slug, slugma? I mean Slugma. Is that probably how you pronounce it? Slugma. Not Slugma. Jeez, I always pronounce it wrong, apparently. Rock though, okay. If this doesn't do too much, it doesn't. Okay, let's go for another side beam then. And we'll hopefully knock this thing out. Oh no, it survived, dang it. Okay. I'm gonna use a shockwave on this thing. This slugma is gonna go down, hopefully, and it does. Awesome. Splink is not level 21, or Twitch is not level 21. And a Numble, awesome. Yeah, let's go for the side beam then. Magnitude, okay, magnitude 7, that's gonna hurt actually. I have a good feeling this is gonna hurt Spoink or Twitch a lot. And it knocks it off, of course it does. Twitch fainted, okay, fine. Let's go to uh, Smokey then. And use Body Slam. Gives Tackle on us, that's not gonna be very, That's not gonna do very much damage, and it didn't, only did 4 HP. There goes the Numble, okay, cool. So we defeated Kendo with Cole, nice. I'm bl I'm blinded by sweat in my eyes. Sorry, man. Thanks for the 740 pocket dollars, though. I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center here real quick, so I'll be right back. Okay, so let's take on the left circle and I guess fall down and take this next circle because it's obvious. It's the only option you have, really. And then let's take on this trainer right here. So this cool trainer probably has a Keklan, I think, at like level 25, and knows a uh, flamethrower, so that's why it's kind of matching with this gym, because flamethrower is a fire type move. Can you Pokemon withstand 392 degrees heat? 392 degree heat? I guess not, but we can try to beat you in battle, is what we can do. Nice. Cool trainer is Zane, okay, he has a Keklan, yeah. Nice. Let's go for the side beam. Now its ability color change will, t will change it into a certain type of the move it got hit by. So yeah, it's a psychic type. Yeah. Now, jeez. Okay. Off range attack super effective. Jeez, oh, critical hit. Okay, I'm gonna switch out. So it's okay. So now it's a, it's now a psychic type. So I guess we can go to Gecko and use um. It does not flame throw. Shoot, because that's gonna be super effective on Gecko or Geico. I guess saying Gecko again, but I can use Pursuit. To change into the dark type, so that's awesome. Yeah, yeah, dark type now. That's oh yeah, flamethrower. I was afraid. I was afraid of that, you know. I was afraid of that. It's a fire type dream after all. Let's go for the quick attack, I guess. Change it back to normal type. And if uh, yeah, kick on this, just flamethrower again. Guy could probably go down, which kind of stinks. Yeah, okay. But we can go to uh, Hariyama now, my fighter, and use Arm Thrust because it'll be super effective because it's back to being a normal type because I have to like quick attack. So yeah, Arm Thrust. Fighting type, okay. And now it's now it's done for. Haha. <laughs> so again, I'm going to have to go back to the Pokemon Center, which kind of stinks. Well, I don't have to, but I want to. <laughs> I didn't burn hotly enough. Sorry, man. Thanks for 1,152 Pokemon always, though. So I'm going to get back into this hole. So I'll be right back. I'm going to go back to the Pokemon Center to heal my Pokemon. Okay, so right back here. Um, I guess there's no trainer right there. I guess... I think we want to go to the top one, if memory serves me correct. Yeah, okay, cool. Because I think if you go into the bottom one, it'll put you back in that section right there with the rectangle. With the two, two holes right there. So, uh, yeah, let's take on this hole next. Yeah. 
And then, yeah, here's the trainer. Nice. So there's another cool trainer. I'm trying to relieve my stress. Don't come along and stress me out. I'm sorry. I just want to Pokemon. I just want to battle you. That's all I wanted to do. I'm sorry. So yeah, Kendall or Axel. Set out number one. Okay. Cool. Let's go for the side beam attack. Hopefully this will be out, do at least half, but I, you never know how much it'll actually do until you actually do it. Magnitude 10, that's gonna hurt. That's almost, that's probably stronger than Earthquake, honestly. It's a magnitude 10. Yeah, okay. Twitch is down. Let's go for, um, Smokey then. Let's go for the Body Slam. Let's just tackle on Smokey, which won't do too much, but it got quick hit. Aw, oh, dang it. Jeez. There we go, the normal goes down, awesome. Slugma, okay, cool, nice. Let's go for the body slam again, or another body slam, I should say. Takes it out in one hit because it's quite, quite awesome. Well, that's awesome. Well, we don't know if the critical would have made it one hit, like, but we can hope, I guess. I think that we defeated youngster. Uh, Kate, I must said youngster. I said there, um, Kendall or Axel. I hope finally flames you good. Oh man. Thanks for seven hundred thirty-six poke dollars. You kind of be mean. Okay, let's see here. Guess I want to go to the right one. I'm hoping that's the right one. I think it is. No, it's not actually. Dang it! Let's go to the top one again because now this one's correct. And then go to this one. And I think we want to go to this one. Yeah, cool, nice. Okay, one of these is a trainer. There we go, this one is a trainer. Cool. Okay, I'll battle with you. Thanks. Glad I really appreciate it. This is a battle girl. It's battle girl, um, Sadie. Okay, cool. Since I'm a tight, cool. Let's go with Smokey, I guess. Let's go for the body slam. Let's give us bite, okay? We have to knock this thing out quick now. This thing's a little higher than us, but that's okay. You have a paralysis, nice. So let's go for the ember. Hopefully it'll finish it off. Nice, okay, cool. Yeah, Smokey's in level 24, awesome. We defeated Battlegirl City, cool, that was easy. Uh, so I skipped the dog, sorry, but thanks for the 576 poker dollars. I think we're gonna go to the top one. Yeah, cool, that was the right one. Okay, yeah. One of these is the, um, the right trainer one, I guess. <laughs> you must be getting tired by now. You look like rest. You like to you you like to rest in hot sand, wouldn't you? But you shouldn't know should know about that. Maintaining your willpower is the important ability for all trainers. That's good to know. I kind of know that already, but whatever. So this is another Kindler, Kindle Kindler Andy. Cool. It's another Slugma. Nice. Slugma. There we go. Still don't think I was saying it right th before I said I corrected myself there. But yeah, so like, Sigma so is paralyzed awesome and can't, paralyzed can't move awesome. Let's use the body slam. And we should faint this thing. Yeah, there we go, nice. There we go, awesome. And another Namu, or a Namu is his other Pokemon, okay. So let's go with the body slam. Magnitude 8, oh man, it's gonna hurt. Okay, this is gonna hurt. I uh, did it too much, that was the lesson I expected actually, so that's good. The body slam hits, and it does a little bit of half, it paralyzed, awesome. And uh, let's use another body slam. Body slam is such a great move in this game, honestly. It's a good move. Okay, we free Kindle with Andy, cool. Play with fire and be burned. Yeah, that's kinda true, thanks for 736 poker dollars though. I think this is the left one to get to, um, finally, because I think this is the last one. Yeah, it gets off one. And uh, yeah, you you um get the friendly awesome. So let's use super potion, I guess. On well, actually, you can use two. Well, let's use super potion just because we have just because we have so many. See how they have smoky front. I'm gonna leave smoky front. So let's talk to friendly from the side. See how it's talk to. Uh, welcome. No wait. Pretty trainer, how good to see you've ma made it here. Uh, I have been exhausted with entrusted with the no wait. I am friendly. And I'm the gym leader here. Uh, dare not underestimate me though. I have been leader only a short time. With skills inherited from my grandfather, I shall, uh, under, I shall demonst uh, demonstrate the hot moves we have honed on this land. 
Okay, cool. So Flannery is a cool looking gym leader. Apparently a lot of people think you know find her attractive. She's she's a she's a good looking gym leader, I should say. But yeah, let's take her on. Let's go okay, she has a slugma. Okay, cool. Let's go for the body slam on this thing. It's level twenty six. So I think she has two slugmas and a torkoal if I read it. If I if I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure that's the case. Okay, so now our fire type moves got really powerful because of sunlight. This is from Sunny Day. Let's go for another body slam. She's probably gonna use a heal item here, which kind of stinks. I should have actually just used um, Ember or something to weaken down a little bit more. Because I think she's gonna use a healing item here. So I'm gonna infer that I'm gonna just you know assume that she's gonna use an item. So I'm gonna just go for another body slam. So she's gonna hyper potion, of course. Fine, whatever. She still pro she still has a slogan about that's paralyzed though. So that's good. It's not really strong. Well, I'll use an Ember this time to weaken it down just a little bit, and hopefully it'll be enough. Okay, there we go. Nice. Okay, that's what I should have done the first time. Because now it's gonna be smog. Okay, darn it. I hate smog. I hate smog so much. Okay, so it did the less than I expected. That's awesome. I only had 3 HP. So I'm gonna use a body slam on it, hopefully, finish it off. And let's see if this does finish it off. It does. Awesome. Okay. She's about to send out her other Sogma. So she does have two Sogmas and a Torkoal. Nice. So, uh, it's not my favorite. Okay, let's go for the Body Slam. I'm pretty sure her Torkoal is female. So it could, uh, it shouldn't attract, um, Smokey because Smokey is also female. So that's good to know. Okay, she probably needs another healing item. Shoot. Let's go for another Ember. Yeah, I knew it. I should have weakened issues Ember first. That's why I'm, that's why I'm not winning here. Jeez, okay. Fine, but we paralyzed it with Bison again. The same, this another one of her Slugmas to her other Slugma, I should say. It's gonna be a sunny day because apparently the sunlight faded or something got bright again. It's got strong. Okay, cool. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use another Ember and then I'm gonna use another Body Slam after that. That should do it though. That's my plan. So she's gonna do some flamethrower. Okay, that's cool. But oh man, a critical hit. Jeez. Fine, we'll use... Jeez, I wasn't expecting that quick. Wait, I'm gonna heal myself, actually. Let's use a, um... I'm gonna heal up all my HP, but all of, uh, Smokey's HP, but I guess we'll have to settle for this right now. Paralyzed, I can't move. Okay, cool. Let's, uh, let's use a, um, Body Slam on this thing. Hopefully finish this thing off. That'd be nice. Body Slam. There we go, awesome, it fence it. And now Smokey's level 25, awesome. Your friend is about to send a Torkoal. I actually want to stay in with my Torkoal, my Smokey. Yeah, her Torkoal is also a little female, so the track will not work. Plus I already have the red fruit too. So let's go for, um, let's try to poison it actually. Smog. Let's go use Bias Lamb on us. So this Torkoal is two levels higher than my Torkoal though. I don't know, he paralyzed Smokey. Shoot. Okay, I'm gonna try another. I'm gonna try another. Um, pros, uh, I'm gonna try another smog. I should say. There we go. Please poison it. Please poison it. Yeah, it did awesome. Nice. Her bad poison. Awesome. Somebody has a four store on Smokey. Gonna yeah, try to go for that epic twinkle sweep. I guess you could say. So yeah. Overheat. Jeez, it's gonna hurt. Well, it's not going to be very effective on Smokey, but still. Yeah, I did over half. Jeez. Okay, fine. Maybe I can't do an Apple Tickle Sweep, because I think if I heal, I'll just use Overheat again. So I'm going to use try for the Body Slam. Let's use Body Slam, okay. Yeah. Oh man, it paralyzed Smokey again. And I hope... Let's see how much this does. I'm, I still have a chance on getting Epic Tickle Sweep, so I'm going to use another full restore on uh, Smokey. There we go, nice. There we go, did a significantly less because of the special attack. That's good for us, actually. So I think we can do it, actually. I think we can go for an epic Torkoal sweep, Torkoal sweep. So let's go for the body slam again. Oh no, PP off for this move, shoot. Okay, let's go for the Ember then. Excuse us body slam, shoot. Oh man, paralyzed it, shoot. Okay. We can 
still do this. Another Ember should go. Oh no, you can just flail. That's actually a smart move. Ah, uh, shoot. Okay, good. Toyko still uh, got a. F Toyko, my Smokey still was able to attack with Ember. Awesome. So that was awesome. My Epic Toyko sweep. Awesome. That's good to know. Awesome. We beat a uh, Finery. Nice. Oh, I guess I was trying too hard. I've I've only always become a gym leader. I tried too hard to be someone I'm not. I have to do things my natural way. If I don't, my Pokemon will be confused. Thanks for teaching me that. For that, you deserve this. Thanks for the 2800 Poké Dollars, and you're welcome for teaching me that lesson. Glad I could help. We have received this heat badge from Franery. Awesome. If you have the heat badge, all Pokemon up to level 50, even those who you gain trades from other people, will obey you completely. And, let's, uh, and it lets you use the HM move strength outside of battle. This is a token of my preaching. Don't be shy about taking it. We get TM50, which is overheat. It's a really good fire type move. I'm actually going to teach that to Smokey in a second. So yeah, the TM50 contains overheat. That move inflicts serious damage on the opponent, but it also sharply cuts the special attack of the Pokemon using it. It, it might be suitable for, it might not be suitable for longer battles. Just like when you use it twice in that battle and it's a longer battle against my Torkoal. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, that's actually true of what, what I'm saying. So we have to go back here and go this way to get to the bay front again. So let's read the statues. Wolverine Town Pokemon Gym. Finally certified trainer Steven. Awesome. Let's talk to the advice to give it again. Yo, that was a scorching hot battle. Thanks, man. Uh, let's teach uh, Wolverine to uh, Smokey now, actually, before I forget. So yeah, Team Overheat. Cool, nice. Team 50 Overheat, yeah. Okay, the only one you can win is Smokey. Smokey would like to win Overheat. However, Smokey already has four moves. Should we move be deleted and replaced with Overheat? Yes. Which we should be forgotten. Let's get rid of, um... Fire spin on us, we don't inspire fire spin anymore. Yeah, one, two, and poof. Smokey forgot fire spin. how to use fire spin, and Smokey learned overheat. Awesome. That's good to know. So, as you exit the Pokemon gym, look who's coming out of that building. It's May. Awesome. Uh, May, Steven, long time no see. Uh, May, oh, while I was visiting the Hot Springs, you got the leverage gym badge. You must have quite good Pokemon. No, no I'm guessing you raised some. That's right, actually, and I caught new Pokemon too. I guess it'd be okay for you to have this with the Go Goggles, which actually will help us uh, see go through that uh, desert route with the Sandstorm. Uh, I think it was at 111, I think. Yeah, put the put, we put it in the camera's pocket with those Go Goggles. You'll have no trouble getting through the desert near Route 111. But ne but wow, Steven, quite challenging gems. You're trying. Hard because you don't want to lose to me. I bet that's true, actually. Steven, I don't think I should challenge your. Steven, I think you should challenge your dad in the Purple Break Gym. We do have four gym badges now, so that's true. Nice. Steven, see you again. Cool. So, I think one of these buildings is actually a Pokemon, but these uh, these items right here, um, they will over happiness. So, keep that in mind in case you're trying to. Um, Teach, uh, trying to evolve a Pokemon through happiness. A beauty powder that restores 50 power points. Energy root restores um, 20, 200 power points. Heal power restores any other problems. A revival herb um, revives, completely revives a Pokemon, I believe. But um, these are slightly less cheaper than actual like revives and full heals and super potions and whatnot. So that's pretty cool. Um, let's buy like two, I guess, of the energy powder. If not, I could actually end up selling them, I think, so that's good. Energy root, let's buy like two. Heal power, I'll actually want to buy more than just two of heal powder. Heal powder, we just buy to buy two. Um, shoot, uh, heal powder, yes, two. Nice. You know, two, that'll be $900. Now we need for items. Oh, that's why, okay. Well, that kind of stinks. We ran out of items. I guess we can sell the um, status conflicting items that we don't need anymore. What else can we sell? The nugget, of course, okay. The burn heal, of course, okay, yeah. Let's do that actually, real quick. Actually, before I do that, I want to help at the Pokemon Center, so I'll be right back. So now that my Pokemon is full healed, I want to check my levels real quick. So yeah, Screamo and uh, Screamo and uh, Smokey can change places, and uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So let's actually do some rearranging of our bag, actually. So yeah, welcome. Sell. So, uh, let's sell the burn heal. 
Let's sell the nugget. And let's sell the let's sell the antidote parasol and stuff. Yeah, let's see. Yeah. And I, I have like a lot of, I already have like an, I already have like full heals and stuff, so I probably sell the lava cookies honestly. I kind of regret buying them now, but that's okay, at least to make some money back from them. And what else can we sell? Let's see, full story, super potion, potion, full heal, revive, escape rope, super power, repel, soda pop, um, yellow fruit, um, blue fruit, red fruit, rare candy, energy powder. Um, energy root. Yeah, okay, cool. And I think the only thing I want to buy actually from that other mart right here, um, is I want to buy the, um, thing that restores your Pokemon completely. Like, um, f it's like a max survive kind of thing, but cheaper, I think. Actually, I can't buy max survive, I'm pretty sure. Survival herb, yeah. Let's buy, um, two of those. Let's buy three of those, actually. Kind of pricey though, so I'm only going to buy like three. But yeah. So let's look at our bag now. It's pretty cool. Should be good then. Energy powder and yeah, okay, cool. I got the right. Nice. So um, we can go down this ledges right here and magically reach the um, the, the um, desert right here. So yeah, I'm at one eleven. So yeah. Who do I have at front again? I think I have Spoink still Twitch. Yes, I do. Okay, cool. So yeah, so this has been my Pokemon Ruby Redo Walk at that part. Next part, we'll take on this uh, desert route and make our way back to Petalburg City, hopefully. So yeah, so this is go again. I would like to thank you for goodbye, and I'll see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Ruby Redo Walkthrough Guide.